Hey, you're quick. Brownian movement, not real movement. What is it? Brownian movement, so you're exciting molecules with the light from the microscope. Oh. Neutrium? That's too big for your pictures, isn't it? How's that? And you were better before. Control blowing on it. I'm looking at your monitor. Is that better? Yeah. Maybe I'll do this and I'll just fix it. Cosmerium. Clostarium is the banana. Oh, okay. Actually, by the way, um, when you said before that you wanted us to you needed to get out of here before. Cosmerium? Yep. No, 4.30. Yeah. Lab has stayed on time today. Okay. If you're going to stay, that's okay, but okay, that's I'm going to take the things away. So, right. you know, that's what I we can make little subsamples or something. So you got to turn the light off this time. Oh. So that's Neutrium. He's big. Sacoderm, one piece. Versus this guy. Yes. He's actually two pieces. So that one's a Clostarium. Clostarium. C L O T S T. It's the banana. Now, what's the one below it? Uh, no. no. It doesn't have the nice chloroplast. It's actually going. It's not the spirogyra, is it? No, it's Mugiosha. The chloroplasts aren't as nice and. They're supposed to be wrapped around, right? No, they're in the middle and they're twisted. Oh, the bow tie pasta? Bow tie pasta, yeah. And look at these guys. That is Eulithrix, chock full of starch. This big globular things in there, that's all starch. Fat little guys. I'm going to have to grow those in nutrient free media. What's this one? Kind of diatom. Fragile area, yes. You know why that's blurry? All these freaking filaments above it. Get out of this. I'll go somewhere else. There's an, here's a nice Cosmarium. There you go. And then we have this guy. Here's Mugiosha. The axial chloroplast. You can see it down the center nicely here. Let's see 
if I can get a better picture for you. It's super dark. Yeah, I'm working on that. It's fuzzy though, blurry. Don't take that, that's ugly. I'm working on it. That's worse.